Hi, this is Dan Tabar of uh, Edamontage. I am uh, co-founder and president, and this is a video for Mari Madaraka on Twitter. So, uh, or anyone else who wants to do uh, Magic of Voxel importing into our platform. So I'm just gonna walk you through this and uh, it'll be real quick and easy. So as you'll see, so going into our website, uh, edamontage.com, let me make sure this is, yeah. At montage.com, you get to our site. You can read about us a little bit. Uh, Mario already knows, of course. Uh, so yeah, just go to make montage over here, right? Uh, big blue button, click that. You're going to have a login screen. Uh, you can just uh, click through with your Google account. And then it's a very th simple three-step process here. You can see uh, uploads and assets and uh, montages, which is the resulting... 3D space in the cloud that you can share with anyone else. So the idea is to get your uh, data first uploaded. Uh, this is a, any Vox file you might have. So let's do, uh, I have some Amari stuff here, like say this one. So I'm just dragging and dropping her file into here. It's a Vox file and boom, it'll upload that. You see, I've already done a few of these so we can jump through uh, the steps here real quick, but you will get something like this uh, when it's done uploading and uh, you can convert it. That's you converting it from one voxel format to our virtual matter format as it's called, uh, but it's it's voxels uh, as well. This is important that you don't interrupt. So we have, we have that, um, we have a new Z test now, but uh, this is the old one. So it doesn't matter the same file. But yeah, just uh, open it up. You can rename it, do whatever you want with it here. But converting it is important. And this is uh, where you give it the name. Um, I'll call it new. You do want to set this to kind of the default here, which is uh, 31 millimeter voxels, I believe. Or maybe one step up, actually. Yeah. For for Mari's stuff, we found that this 15 millimeter voxels makes uh, for the nicest result. And then apply shading to make uh, stuff that is in corners and stuff be more dark <laughs> and and also have some cast shadows and stuff. This is going to be something we don't recommend later. We are working on getting in uh, real-time lighting and shading, so this won't be applicable. But uh, for now, this is a good, good thing to do. And then you just start that. It will get queued. It will start processing here. You can navigate away at this point, uh, and I will, but you'll see that your thing is still being processed now great and it'll take take a little while when it's done it'll be essentially like this you can go show it which just jumps you over to the next step here which is assets that's the result of the conversion or the processing of your data and we have a piece here that's um the result of it it's the i did a couple of these before you can do multiple of these conversions play with the resolution and parameters there. There's not much to do with voxel input because voxels to voxels is pretty straightforward. But uh, as you see here, it is done. This is coming very soon. So you can start edit your things here and fix them up in our editors, uh, which are like Photoshop for 3D style tools. You can do all kinds of really interesting things there uh, that you may not have been able to before, but we can now also go to montages and here you will see a big green button to start a free trial. This is, uh, yeah, completely free. You don't have to have a credit card or anything. You can try things out as much as you want, uh, for two weeks. There are also going to be uh, game development montages there soon, which is going to be free basically forever to be building in. We have a revenue share model coming in for those when you monetize those yourself, but for the non game kind of use case, there is these free uh, two week trials. And uh, it's very easy to just go in and edit those. You've uh, pressed that green button and gotten your free trial started. Now when you press the button, there will be a little bit of a startup of the montage itself. But now the assets that you've created, again, back here, will be available to add here. So you will have a kind of a blank slate in here, there's nothing in here. You go add asset and we will add oh any of these things that that i've done before so here is one of mari's beautiful one of uh, her beautiful things of course um that she makes like 
with such, um, I don't know, just incredible skill. <laughs> I don't know how she does this, but all this, all this detail is in here. And uh, the cool thing is that you can scale this, you can make this big, small, you can move it around with these familiar gizmos. Uh, and uh, you can, of course, add more of these. So we can have two of these next to each other. And you can start building a scene with these incredible pieces. The sky is kind of placeholder. We have new versions coming out here with much more pretty sky and also lighting as well that matches the sky. So there's going to be really nice um, atmosphere in general. Also fog and this kind of thing is coming in very soon, but at least you can get started, Marty, on this um, uh, process of seeing how your stuff ends up when you export it from Magic Voxel into this montage that you can then share, of course. Uh, that's the point. So you are able to copy to clipboard this URL or just copy up here is fine to anyone in the world and they can check this out and they can do it on their phone now. That's the really cool part, right? So go to the app store or the play store and just search for at a montage client or just type in at a montage. We're going to be the only, only thing there. You can install that app. And as soon as you tap on this link that somebody sent to you, or you found on Twitter or, uh, it will connect and you are able to explore this as an avatar that you can also customize and you can see each other. You can talk to each other with chat. Uh, and, uh, that's it. That's the process. It's uh, very simple as you can, as you can tell, start, start here, upload pretty much. You will end up with an asset that you can then add to your montage, uh, your trial montage. And you can be in here looking at things at, uh, in this kind of flying around way. And what's coming very soon is, uh, Mari, you've already seen this, but it's uh, the walking controller where you can walk around very much like Minecraft or Roblox or something, you know, in a first person view. And this is coming in the, in the next few weeks or so, I would say, but, uh, yeah, it's, uh, super fun actually to walk around and like really immersive to walk into your, your creations like this, instead of trying to fly in here, I would walk in and actually explore this in this much more intuitive, interesting way. And you can walk up the stairs and all this stuff and explore it like in, like you would, uh, some kind of church or building or something. So that's it. Um, if you have any questions, uh, let us know. This is, uh, just, uh, reach out contact at, at a montage.com. Happy to reply there. Uh, Mari, you know how to get a hold of us more directly. Um, but everyone else really it's either that email or join our discord server. So it's at a montage uh, forward slash discord, or just hit this up here and you'll get a way to get to our discord server, of course. So yeah, join the community and, uh, start adding your magic of voxel output in here, super quick and easy, even if it's very large, you know, these are hundreds of megs, uh, files that, um, have no problem uploading and turning into virtual matter that you can add, you can add a lot of these, you can keep, keep adding, you know, um, so go nuts with it. We have uh, another one here that's beautiful palace. And sometimes it might take a second for it to actually load on the server, but here you go. It was maybe two seconds. So cool. All right, guys, that's it. Good luck. And I can't wait to see some stuff that you, you put on here and, and share. Uh, go nuts with it. All right.